This is the pre-build preparations for the full mechanics aerial from Witch from Mercury. When customizing your gun plot, you're going to be working with things like model glues, various types of paints, and also solvents like paint thinner or isopropyl alcohol are the two most common ones. You want to make sure that you're in a well-ventilated room because you don't want to be uh, inhaling the fumes because they could cause health issues or at the very least make you feel intoxicated. You're going to want to read any warning labels on any products that you use or do some research online to see if there's additional health uh, safety measures you need to take, such as respiratory gear or anything such like that. If you are working with isopropyl alcohol, do keep in mind that that is a wood alcohol which can cause serious health issues, including blindness if consumed. So you want to make sure that you definitely wash your hands after any exposure to it to make sure that you don't get it in your food later on. I'm ready to do the panel lining now. And as normal, I will be using my three standard colors. I'll be using my dark gray for the white pieces. I will be using the dark brown for the red pieces and black for everything else. The one exception is this kit comes with some metallic red pieces. I'm keeping them in the bag because I want to protect the metallic coating on these. And I will be using red, I'm sorry, I will be using black as the panel lining for these pieces because these pieces will be underneath uh, smoky clear um, plastic. So the, the, I don't think the brown will pop out as much as if I, so I'm going to be using black instead because just because they go underneath. And also I think just the, the darker color and the shininess is going to be better with the black instead. So I just wanted to point that out before I started. I'll be doing this last. So let's just get on right on into this.
have had a chance to dry fully so I'm going to go ahead and start the cleanup. I've got my precision cotton swabs and my good old Despe enamel thinner so I'm ready to go so why don't we just get right on into this. <music>
Okay, now that the panel lining has been completed and cleaned up, I'll go ahead and start taking the pieces off the runners. And uh, I've got my organizers here so I can keep the pieces together per section. So we'll go right on into this and get this started.
watching this video right to the end. If you did enjoy it, please do give it a thumbs up. That does help out the channel. If you would like notifications as to when new videos are posted to this channel, please do subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you do have time, please do enjoy one of the videos that are popping up around my head.